uh, were a uh, noun or a verb or half or letter. Okay. In uh, in the question words in the Arabic language, we have two categories. We have it's me. Uh, it's uh, we have the half and the noun. Ism and half. Ism noun and half letter. Okay. We'll start with the half. Uh, if I want to say, do you have a pen? In Arabic, I will say, a indaka qalam, a indaka qalam. Okay. So, a indaka qalam means, do you have pen? I have just one letter here. It's my word of question here. And the second is, hal ta'ti ma'i. Hal ta'ti ma'i, will you come with me? Or uh, are you coming with, with me? Hal ta'ti ma'i. Okay, so... This form, it's uh, when we say in English, it's like when we say in English, do you or will you or... And the answer is always yes or no. Jawa, the answer is yes or no. Naam, awla. A'indaka qalam? Naam, tafaddal. Yes, go ahead. And, um, or, hal ta'ti mai? Will you come with me? La, asif. No, sorry. Okay. The second group of the uh, question word in the Arabic language <coughs> are ism. I have the majority here are the most or the most common in the Arabic language. I have the first one is manja'a. Manja'a. Who came? Manja'a. So men it means who. Who came? Men. Manja'a. The second is ma. Ma ismuk. What is your name? So ma means what? And I have ماذا تعمل? What do you do? ماذا تعمل? ماذا here it's what also, but in Arabic the difference between ma and ماذا is ما is a general question. I can ask I use it anywhere. But ماذا I use it just when I'm asking about an action. So here, ماذا تعمل؟ تعمل أنت تعمل؟ I have فعل في المضارع a present verb. Okay. The third is أي فريق فاز؟ أي فريق فاز؟ Which team won the match? Which team won? So أي فريق فاز؟ فاز is فعل ماضي. هو فاز. Okay. After, I didn't have a place here, so I got it here. <laughs> okay. So, four is Aina. Aina Tescon. Where? Aina means where? Where do you live? Uh, do you, yes, where do you live? Okay. Aina Tescon. Tescon. Aina Tescon, where do you live? And uh, the fifth is Mata Tati. Mata Tati, it means uh, when you will come. Or when are, when are you coming? متى تأتي متى is when تأتي أنت تأتي is a verb in the present with أنت okay. with you أنت six كم عمرك كم عمرك how old are you كم عمرك and I can say it also uh, كم الساعة what time is it so كم is when I want to speak about uh, Oh, the answer is a number. Okay, so when I say, I say, Kem Amaruk, you will tell me a number. Kem uh, is you will tell me a number also. So, Kem, uh, it's, uh, okay, it's maybe Kem uh, Amaruk, how old are you? Or Kem Sa'a, what time is it? The last one is Kaifa. Kaifa. Kaifa Haluk, you know it. Kaifa Haluk means, um, what mean? Kaifa haluk? It means uh, how are you? How? How? So kaifa it's how. I repeat. Men who? Ma and mada what? Ayu which? Aina where? Meta when? Kem. Uh, it's generally how or no? Kem it's uh, how old are you or? Well, it's generally when the answer is a number. And in the last, I have كيف حالك? How? كيف is how? 